up guys and gals and you diabolical fanboys it's your girl rj with second union and if you happen to catch our promo video last week or maybe you've just stumbled upon this video i want to let you know that the second union crew is going to start bringing you their top five pop culture hits every single week welcome to the to you we can read Kicking it off with number five, we've got the release of the Dragon Ball Fighter Z video game. It came out on the 26th of January to PC, Xbox One, and your PS4. Now this game is going to give you three-on-three -three team battles, as well as 2D backgrounds with 3D fighters. So if you're a Dragon Ball Z fan, definitely check it out. Season four of iZombie is kicking off on the CW February 26th. And things have gotten a little complicated. The zombies are out of the closet, and there's a lot of tension on the streets. Not only that, the whole city is quarantined. So make sure you check out that premiere. Carrie Fisher's star continues to burn bright as she won her first Grammy Award for Best Spoken Word Album for her memoir, The Princess Diarist. She was nominated previously in 2009, but this was her first win. All right, guys, the Ant-Man and Wasp movie hits theaters on July 6th, and here's a little clip of the new trailer. I definitely think Paul Rudd and Evangeline Lilly make a great team, and I can't wait to watch this kick-butt film. And our number one pick for this week, Wakanda took over Hollywood as the purple carpet was rolled out for the premiere of the Black Panther movie. The cast showed up and showed out in awesome attire. This is one of my most anticipated movies of 2018. All right, guys, I'm RJ, your host. Thanks so much for joining us for the To You Week in Review. Don't forget, these videos go up every Sunday, 9 p.m. Eastern Time, and we'll see you next week.